Hi Cancer, it's Elle here to do your September, your mid-September 2019 general reading. It's a general reading. It will not resonate with every Cancer. If it does resonate with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. It is a way you can show your support to the channel. It's free. Click that like button, okay? Thank you to those who do so. All right, let's get into it. So, Cancer, I'm led to pull situation, advice, outcome, and what you don't see coming. Hmm. So, what's the situation for Cancer? Whoa, way too many cards. Let's get back into it. What's the situation? Okay. What's the advice for Cancer? Okay, two cards want to come out. We'll let it. And the outcome for cancer. What's the outcome for cancer? All right. What's the outcome for cancer? What is it cancer cannot see? What is it that the cancer cannot see? Okay, so Cancer, the situation for you is the King of Water. Maybe you, you're coming up. All right, the advice here for you is the Three of Fire, the Knight of Fire. Wow, a lot of action. It says take action, Cancer. The outcome is the Nine of Earth. This came out off camera for you. This is beautiful. Okay, what you don't see is the four of earth and the two of air. Hmm. Okay, Cancer. So, September, mid-September 2019. It looks like you come into the situation. What the situation is, is you balanced. You showing reservation about how you feel in regards to family, friends, siblings. What others have to say. Nothing it's rocking you too far to the left or too far to the right. There may be something that you're waiting on. It may be coming in for you. It could be the opportunity to move, to physically move home. And it brings you to a level of abundance and independence, enjoying that luxury of. There's also an air of you're waiting to take action in regards to something or someone else. Because what you don't see is that somebody else is holding on. Someone may be in financial trouble or upheaval or that just at a place of maintaining could be a Libra person, could be Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, anyone. Look, fires here, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. What you don't see coming is uh, someone, or what you, maybe it, you could be very perceptive and see that this person is at a place of not wanting to commit to any position because of maybe financial issues or there there uh yeah there's an upheaval they have some some issues with home home family and in in laying of roots this person may be starting over or this person maybe they they shifted or they uprooted themselves so they're not in a position of um making any real decision
it also could be that what you don't see coming is that there might be a status change shift for you in a particular relationship but then there's also someone holding on the advice here is for you to take action uh, you know that there can be expansion and abundance with something or someone make long-term plans and take action here because it'll lead you the outcome to a place of being able to partner or align yourself with maybe something that is more feasible something more to your liking something that you enjoy or someone you enjoy what you don't see is there's someone holding on what is this four of earth and the two of swords someone unable to make a decision right the devil in reverse this might be a person you're dealing with or in a commitment with you've made commitment with someone is still holding on um but at the same time trying to come out of making a bad choice choices that lead them to long yeah pay the source so let's this could be you cancer, you're trying to do your homework, gain insight. Someone could be spying on you too. What is this about? We got the page of swords here with the devil in reverse. Ace of Pentacles. What you don't see is maybe somebody's coming out of fear frustration and being unable to move this could be someone younger than you this could be someone who ask is a, they ask I said ask is mm, new word they ask a lot of questions or this is you asking the probing question in regards to someone else and how they're moving and what they're doing because you want to be able to establish something new, firm with them. You might, this the Ace of Pentacles talks about engagement also, moving in together. It's like, do right, and then we get the moving card, and the moving card. We got something moving rather rapidly, quickly. The star card under the deck could be dealing with an Aquarius. Or this just says that Cancer, you're on the right path in regards to moving something forward and being perceptive, um, intuitive in regards to dealing with someone. You may feel as if someone needs help. They may not be letting in on what is really going on with them or vice versa. This is you, Cancer, and someone is saying this about you or they know this about you without you even telling. Um, but whatever it is, they want to be the, the rescuer in this situation they don't mind stepping in or you don't mind stepping in it almost feels as if it is opportunity to have exactly what you want the ten of pentacles ace and nine is ten it, it, you want to bring this together or they want to bring it together but there's an air of maybe this person doesn't feel as confident as they should or would have in past situations because of This is either you, you cancer, or the other person. What is the three of fire and the knight of fire? Some of you want to, some of you want to engage with someone in a third party situation. And it's going to lead you to really embarking on your singlehood. And really taking some strides and some steps to becoming single because you want to be able to start something really foundational and new you also get wish fulfillment here something that you, you asked for is coming in something that you felt like you or who, who you felt like you were without is here right support new exercise program take action here be active 
yeah you know, like you, you someone needs support you feel it you know it family changes yeah you it's like moving in together or moving closer together some of you are either concerned with retirement you are retiring from one situation going into another retiring from one way of making money going to another retiring from full-time work now maybe reducing to part-time work family changes could be an announcement of divorce separation engagement baby new pet new house new dog new appliance announcement of something what is at the bottom of the deck is a five of water this is hesitation someone stuck could be you cancer could be wow you could definitely be dealing with an aquarius get the king of air yeah someone's stuck in what was and not living in what is now they can't see what you could be to them or vice versa cancer you can't see what this person is or what they can be for you or to you there's somebody who does some really skilled work we have some legal background we got medical um we've got someone who's really skilled someone who they have to continuously what continue in education they have to do that um we have an, another person who's very perceptive and that could be you cancer that could be the other person there's somebody coming out of hardship they need to understand that it's over it may be over by way of a blessing of that is a particular person because we have the emperor at the bottom of the deck. There could be a dynamic of age difference here because we had a page of swords and then we have the emperor and then we have two knights which could definitely stand for cancer the two horses um, then we have support cancer it just seems like they're either you or someone else has completely uprooted their life for you it poses the opportunity for you to swoop in and play the knight in shining armor but this other person is so very uh used to being very independent very in charge of in control of they may be still crying over what was and what used to be and not living in what is now this could be you cancer you trying to move forward with maybe the king of air this is typically Libra or Aquarius. It can be Gemini, but this is typically Libra or Aquarius. Um, trying to move forward with this person, but still harboring over what happened. Still, your feelings, you need to grieve. And you might need to find a support system that helps you move past what happened let's see um what's the best course of advice for cancer some of you is a career move it's a shift what you know what what are these family changes for cancer mid September going into October what are these family changes hey 
Wow, the star again, the six of pentacles. This could be a blessing by way of someone becoming uh, with child. Or you making a pact with someone. Definitely an announcement of some sort. What is this? An announcement of like proclaiming that you're going to be with or be in relationship with that you made the choice to give to this is moving somebody's moving definitely making a choice to go after their own desires their own hearts desire um, someone's moving with or moving in or Fool in reverse. Nine of Cups in reverse. Six of Swords upright again. Seven of Wands in reverse. Someone's moving. Someone's helping someone move. But you may be stating the, the terms of that. Like, I'm not moving with you, but I expect to have a key or you do something for someone, cancer or vice versa, them for you. And it allows for you to, to kind of put your guard down or them put their guard down. Someone still feels tied to and bound to. Bound to a dutiful relationship that is not fulfilling. That it has it comes with duties and burdens. They continuously do it. Because this is what they signed up for. Somebody is what is this about? Yeah, somebody's trying to conceive. But it's I don't think it's taking. Hmm. Somebody's trying to conceive here. I mean, you got a lot going on. So many situations here. Someone is saying, I can't go down that path with you and I want to make peace with you somebody's apologizing for not being able to do exactly what it is you want them to do cancer or vice versa someone is willingly staying in a situation a marriage some type of merger that is dutiful. I'm, I'm living out my duty. This is what I signed up for. 
Someone could be sick. Someone could be hurting, not well, if not all the time. Not they're not well most times. Someone feels like it was, it was written in the stars. It was destined for them to meet a particular person. And now they have to um, come to a place of trying to figure out how to be with this person. And then as I say that, the two of pentacles comes out talks about two very real options trying to choose between two things that have manifest in your life two things that you're in between you you habitually give your time energy effort money love respect to both sometimes the other one gets more sometimes the other one gets less says cancer you know what the answer is the hermit card the answer is within you you're looking for answers outside of yourself the answer is going to come from in you once you are filled with spirit once you find that place of emotional elation and, and feeling Having that inner feeling of knowing that you're just on the right track. Knowing that without a sure, sure of a doubt that you're on the right path. Right? Yeah. Coming out of that hangman situation where things are stale and stuck, stagnant. Understanding that in order to have what it is I want, I must sacrifice. Making decisions in permanence. Like, I know I can't go back from this. I think some of, yeah, wow, you become the magician in your own life. You stand firm in what it is you, you want or who you want. You avoid the disaster of, but some I heard exposing yourself. For some of you, it still comes in as if you are unable to walk away from or something bounds you or holds you to um, a situation of a being in something that you feel you're obligated to. Let's close this out. Nine of water, you can have what you want. Your wish could come true. Eight of water. If you walk away from all that does not fulfill you. You have the desire to move on, but once again you gotta spiritually grow. That ace of cups, two of earth, you have a decision to make. There's a lot going on. Um consider the Empress, uh lavish abundance and once again, giving birth to your dreams or your your child. Some of you, it's gonna. It's like, can we afford this? It might be in vitro or something of that nature. It looks like you, you come out victorious. You may have a change of home or journey because of discontentment, and boredom, where you are. You may uproot yourself here. All right, Cancer, all over the place. But the overall message is that someone wants to leave, but they're still stuck and tied to. Someone wants to stay, but they're uh, in a situation that is, has no love, no likeness, but it's what you signed up for. Uh, the best course of advice or the best advice here is to go after what it is you want, 
you have victory there. Some of you are trying to conceive. It says stick to it. Keep at it. It will happen for you. Some of you, once again, retirement. Trying to retire one position and go to another. That could be one person and go into another person. All right, Cancer. If it resonated, it resonated. Thank you for being here. Take care. Many blessings. All links are below. Bye.